Hi there, I'm Jeffrey Kevin and welcome to my channel, Decorating Happily Ever After. Today, I'm going to be doing a party, uh, be setting the table for my nephew. Uh, we're going to be doing a lamb chop thing. Lamb chop has been a big part of our family since he was a little child. At his bedtime, lamb chop always helped him to get to bed. So I thought it would be a cute thing. It is retro, kind of old school, so I had to look on eBay. You can't find these things uh, in, in stores anymore, but I found the plates. Uh, I've got the paper napkins. We've got the noisemakers and a little party uh, decoration for the table. Also today, I'm going to, instead of doing plastic flatware, I've got some cute polka dot flatware that I'm going to use. And uh, as a charger plate, I'm going to be using some ceramic red plates uh, and using the paper plates more as our dessert plate. And that way we can put food items on the larger plate. Uh, I've got some cake stands that I'm going to use. I've got the black, I've got the red. I'm going to be mixing those in, using those as uh, for my cupcakes and as props to lift things up, make different heights. And then I've also got uh, our little party bags, favor bags that I'm going to have, various things. We've got a pinata that we're going to use. Later on, this will go outside, but for now, it's going to be a table decoration. So let's get started. Flatware today, I'm going to use some polka dot flatware. Uh, I think I ordered this from Jenny's, it's a Miller catalog company. And I thought, rather than, even though we've got paper plates, I thought rather than doing um, plastic, we we'll just do something a little bit, a little bit. We've got kids always like markers, coloring book, some crazy string, slap on bracelet, and you can put candy or what whatever you want in there, but that's what I'm gonna do for today. And I'm just gonna get some little tissue and put in there. We can't have a lamb chop party without lamb chop. Just start the show. One thing that I do, guys, 
uh, on the treat bag. Sometimes the little kids, they're anxious and they want to start present unwrapping immediately. And so what I do is when they first get here, I let them go ahead and have the treat bags and start. <laughs> And so that clears them off the table, gets them out of the way, and they've got some little things to keep their attention. So I, those, like I said, they look a little big here, and I have to use smaller ones, but uh, like I said, they go away pretty quickly. Kids will unwrap them, they're tossed in the floor and gone, and then you've got better access to everything else. But I usually just let them have them first, and then that way it gives them a little something to tantalize them until time to open the big gifts. And uh, on the cake stands, I've just made a tier here with them. Um, like I said, if your chandelier is not in the way, you can go up one more level. I've just got simple cupcakes, and I frosted them just in a real simple way with a star tip. But like I said, they're uh, festive and cute for kids. Later, the um, pinata take you outside, and there'll be one more treat at the end of the day. enjoyed this video if you did be sure and give it a like subscribe to my channel hit the notifications button so that in the future you can get notifications when I put out new videos I'm Jeffrey Kevin hoping that you decorate happily ever after bye bye now